And hundreds of people turned out today to support Republican congressional candidate Rick Saccone. He's running for the seat formerly held by Tim Murphy. And the vice president had some encouraging words for his party's candidate. Paul Martino is live in Bethel Park with more. Paul. Ken, you know, this district, the 18th district, it should be a safe seat for Republicans, but it's clear they are fighting hard to hold on to this seat. President Trump's already campaigned here. Today, it was Vice President Pence's turn. Thank you. Thank you. This was Rick Saccone's day in Bethel Park. The state rep hopes to take over the seat left vacant by disgraced Congressman Tim Murphy. This campaign is about something bigger than all of us. It's about making America great again. Are you with us? But the star of the event was Vice President Mike Pence, who played the Republicans' greatest hits for the crowd in Bethel Park. With Rick Saccone in Congress, we're going to pass a historic infrastructure bill, and we're going to rebuild America. With Rick Saccone in Congress, we're going to fix a broken immigration system. And with Rick Saccone in Congress, we're going to build a wall. While President Trump won this district by 20 points, special elections are tricky. It's hard to get voters out. It's even difficult for sitting congressmen to get the date right. On March the 14th, we've got to show up. We've got to show up in such great numbers. The, all right, the 13th. <laughs> yeah, it is on March the 13th, and that's going to be the problem. Are voters even aware there's a special election? And do they even know the date? That's going to be one of the challenges of this campaign to get their voters out. And by the way, they spoke a lot about Rick Saccone's opponent, Connor Lamb, today, painting him as a Nancy Pelosi liberal over and over. Reporting live from Bethel Park, Paul Martino, KDKA TV News.